Okay, I have an idea of what we're gonna do in this here. So, um, I did sleep on it. And I think the best thing to do is build a dedicated ship for going up to space and doing various works. Now, I am very te tempted to take Bob and modify so that we can take it to space. Oh. That's what I get for going on with the thruster. Alright, let's connect this here up and see what we can do to it. Alright, let's connect. Actually, before we connect up, let's change a few things about uh, in terms of batteries. Bob, let's call this. Um. Um. Voyage? Yeah, there we go. Builders. Our Japanese sisters. CC. Voyage CC. There we go. And oh yeah, info. Voyage. And what we'll do is we'll connect this here up and modify. Okay. Six. I just need to re do all these here. So that's um, groups is thrusters and recharge and builders. There we go. There we go. Now let's see what we're going to be doing on. Is it is this one, isn't it? Or is it? Yeah, this is it here. Yeah, right. Let me think. I might actually be better just completely building a new one. Hmm. Hmm. I don't need this. Yeah, let's actually turn the builders on. And let me see. Yeah, four. Nah, um, let me see what we actually need. Right, I think we'll get rid of this here first. And this. Um, that's okay where it is. Those builders are okay where they are. Yeah, those builders are okay where they are, those builders are okay where they are. We just need to replicate what we see this side. On the other side. So, let me see. Yeah. There, and then there's one here. I think. Yeah. And another one. And uh, let's go another one. And here. Hmm. Now this is where the thrusters will be adjusted accordingly. So you know, um, hydrogen in there. And let's put another one in here. And here. Okay. So that's going there. Let's get some O2 generators. Put them here. Yeah. There. And there. And. 
Hmm. Hydrogen. I have an idea on what we can do in that. So let's take this here off. Because we don't need it. All these go off. Hook everyone up. Let's get rid of them panels as well. Don't need them. Hmm. Let's hook everyone up to this. here up. Oh, what is that actually? Oh, it's missing thrusters, right. Hmm. Do you want to keep them batteries there? Let's get a cargo. A conveyor. And replace that here. And I'll put that here. And we need interior plate. in here and let's get a hydrogen now this is where things are going to get a bit tricky so that's going to go there oh wait no that's going to go here another battery here and I'm thinking about a single one on the center I know going around the sides so four left and and then one on each side, large one on all sides, or smaller ones. this ship. See about there. No, that's the middle. So this is here. Let's send that up and across. there I'll put this in here on the back like that actually no, let's take it suppose yeah why not let's put it as close as possible to this
and then ones for going forward and backwards can be little ones like this. Next thing can we probably take that in closer could be no. So that's four. That was five. So I wonder if we can get another one somewhere. Two more going this way because that won't fight out in here. Yeah, let's put another one there. Another one going here. Now I just hook these here up together. Suppose they can go up and add over. Yeah, let's try that. And try this here. And that goes there. Junction block. And junction block. Inventory full. And junction block. And goes out. Oh, maybe not. We could technically replace those large ones for our ones going here on the sides. I'm just going to burn through a lot of hydrogen, I reckon. What's it missing? Metal grids are okay, let's get some of them built. Um, I do need to make sure that everything's off. The builders, or else it won't work. Production assembler. Let's make um heavy. And uh, yeah, I should have that work away. Time to do some moving here. I can't move. It's kind of tempted to put this coming up and add to here. Yeah, and then put the engine here on this block. Yeah, let's do that.
and then um, let's see let's get rid of all this and that will come up and go to these instead so when you join all this here up just um temporarily going in there and this is going in here and then we link the whole system up together oh that's a um, didn't realize what block that was that and let's do the same with this here And then put two of these in the front. And then these can be used to like lift up yeah it looks the part now right let's set um them tanks back to stop pile Stuck by them. We'll put a temporary landing gear on it. Looks good. Let's turn that off. And six. There we go. And then we 
get all the hydrogen thrusters. That's our named. And what we'll do is we'll do this. O2. And hedge tank. There we go. That is everything we need. Let's add all this here um, to the build. So that is on, on. Good. Let's take a look to burn it. Okay, and B. Oh, there's no gyros in this thing, I just remembered. Um, I forgot about the gyros. Right, they're gonna have to go. I suppose they can go in here. There we go. And let's build that. There we go. That is Evan built. Looking good. Does have a lot of thrusters, but it helps. And I guess where we need to go. Now we just need to go and get some ice. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna make another copy of Bob. Make another one. And then we're gonna call it um Iceman. Or what else could we call that? Mmm. What characters are ice? The Iceman. Eh. Uh, yeah, let's call it Iceman. Can't think of anything else to call it. Right, so what we'll do is hope we get that projector. We do. Let's take this one back. Um. Take it back. That'll do there. And we'll just press it down. There we go. And let's turn on this one. Let's build it.
Okay, we have got the ice man ready to go. So let's go and get some ice. And just before we continue, we're going to take a blueprint of this. There we go, ice man. Right, let's take this to the ice field. And there we go. Let's take a look at the ice. There we go. Drain that out. And we are currently done the build process for the platform. So in that uh, we part of the tutorial. So in that we part there, we just seen the rest of this here platform being done. As you can see, it's just mounted here, so it makes it easier for sort of vehicles to drive in and then turn and go in here. And I did make it wide enough so that you no know, vehicles can do like 
um, a left hand turn or a right hand turn in in there. Um, if needed, we can come out a bit further. It's not that hard. Just extend this, but um, I think it's big enough anyway. I've added on these here red lights as well. They're just to mark the edges so it's easier to see at night. Um, I must apologize in advance. I have a fan going in the background. I'm currently recording this at 20 past 1 at night and it is currently 25 degrees Celsius. It is really hot and my arms are sticking to the table <laughs> with sweat. <laughs> so yeah, it's not going to be a fun night now. Uh, but the fan is helping a lot and if it wasn't there, um, I think I'd be suffering. I'd be melting like a snow cone. Right, um, okay, so we're going to take, uh, which one is this? Um, that's Iceman, that's Bob, and that one, we haven't actually given that a name. Oh, we actually haven't given that a name yet, have we? Voyage, yeah. Um, we could do another port up here to connect stuff. I can't connect that onto the side of that because it's... It's close enough to those thrusters. Um, so what we might do actually is park this off to the side again. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just uh, take it on round. Yeah, that'll do. Go on round. Hopefully the game is a lot smoother. I have um, adjusted the recorder settings to be high instead of medium. But the game still remains at medium settings and it's a lot better. Okay, I'm going to put this here down here. There we are. And... Yeah, it'll do. Okay, let's check Voyage. See if it's ready to go yet. I don't think it is. It is getting close there. 99. 99. Oh. No, that's going up now. Um, let me just check to see if we can stockpile. So I'm just going to go here, groups, and um, voyage. And let's set these here to stockpile. Did you see that fill up in real time? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So that's that stockpile. We'll, let, we'll just leave that to stockpile. Um, I think what we can do is let me see. Just check that the all the batteries. All right. So all the batteries on this here are not set to the same groups. You can see these here are still on to um, G charge. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually take it momentarily off this here. Seven is, and then we're going to back it up. Change to auto. Let's back it up slowly. And let's land it. That'll do there. Okay. And seven stock bats, we're not wasting it. And let's turn off the builders. And let me check to see if the builders are on the. Yeah, it's okay. Um, right, let's do the batteries. Uh, this was something I was meant to do. Yes, but I had forgotten. Um, so we're going to do the batteries first. Uh, batteries of voyage. And we need to add on. Yeah. Doesn't know. Yeah, the wear on the group is just the wear flicking between on and off. Right, let's. There we are, that's better. Okay. Let's get it connected back up. It is very quick. I wouldn't mind taking that for a bit of a test run. Okay, six, seven, recharge. Right, that looks good. All good there. So that's going to stockpile and keep it stockpiled up. Um, I think what we can do is, while that's just meddling away there, um, we could get the big basics of a base going and what we can do is we could either dismantle the base and then get this here to pick up the parts 
then we take the projection of the well before we dismantle it we take the projection of the base and then we put on a projector here and what we can do is we can connect it to like a point on the ground put the projector on project the uh, the base and then let it build away um, but I'm thinking maybe it's just better going to the moon itself with all this here stuff which I think is better yeah yeah um, let's see um, a bit confused there. <laughs> um, I was meant to go to this here instead, instead I went over to the connector. Right, I'm just going to make sure that all my stuff is um, ready to go. So what we're going to do is we're going to fill up on the hydrogen first. There we go. Uh, we only have one oxygen bottle, so I am going to get a second one. Uh, we don't have any, so let's get one of those made. Uh, and we need to go to this, and we need another one of these. There we go. Uh, ox, there we are. Give me that goodness. Um, power kits. Um, can we make them? Can we make a power cat? What's that? Apostrophe, alright. How do we make those? Uh. Oh, I think you have to find them. I don't know. That's weird. Yeah, uh, I'll not worry about that for now. Um, also, the other thing as well is we haven't found any of the economy stations yet. So what I might do is I might make... Um, there was a ship uh, that's very, very basic. It's out in the fair trusters. And what I was thinking was flying that around until we find it. It's very easy to find. It's just um, we just need to pick up the, the signal from it. Now, typically that is 40 kilometers away from the starting base. That's what I've noticed anyway. It's usually about 40 to 50 kilometers away. So all we have to do is just sort of fly around. Um, probably better just doing an orbit and eventually find it. So what you do is you do an orbit going sort of this direction here. And you come back around. And then what you do is you start here and you go that way. And then you will eventually find it. That's the way I've done it. Uh, so I think we should do that soon enough. Because with the economy we can get things like uranium. Uh, which would be good. Uh, I'd rather... Well, uh, there is a bit of no um, challenge going for the bases and getting the uranium, uranium and then going for asteroids, but with the economy, it's a lot easier. And uh, we can just go from back and then we're getting points as well, so that's good. Because we can do like um, search and rescue missions, so I might made a dedicated ship for all that stuff. Right, um, let me think. I think we should. I think what I do is I'm gonna put this here done and then what we're gonna do is I'm gonna load up the blueprints and uh, not the blueprints but you know like the build planner for all the stuff we need take it from this load it into this here manually so go over and back and then just stuff the rest with no plates because we'll be just building blocks interior plates and the rest the whole spang uh, metal grids uh, the other thing as well is do we want to put defense systems on this um, Probably. Space is the most dangerous part of this game. Now, that's the reason why I haven't really connected to that like much. It's because I know if you stay on it too long, you will eventually catch uh, the enemy's eye, and it is not defense. Um. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. So what we'll do is we'll take this here down, and so we'll go this way, this one, recharges off, and six. There we go. One, two, and three. No, I'll keep that on. Seven stockpile. There we are. Um, actually, I'm going to take that projector off the um, the toolbar because we don't need it. I don't know why the game skips like that. It's it's weird. I, I keep maybe it does it whenever it saves. I don't know. It's weird. 
Um, right, yeah, we'll do that. So we need um, five assemblers. Do five assemblers, five uh, refineries. Yeah, let's get... There we go, let's get all that stuff. Let's take um, that. That'll do, yeah. Alright, let me see what we're like for stuff. Yeah, I think we're good. Um, let's get a few more displays. We don't look like we have enough. Because we'll be looking to make some more interfaces in the future. Oh, a medical bay as well. Let's get one of those. Um, let's see. Let's get a medical. There we are. Um, oh, just need the one. Um... Let's go to production and make that one. There we go. And then, uh, is it on our build menu? It is. So let's uh, take this here off um, and then throw that stuff in. I think we're alright for stuff there, yeah. Right, um, let's get the rest of that stuff. And uh, throw that there. So we've got our medical bay. Um, and now we can just make... It's just that medical bay, I think it requires silver. And it'll be hard enough to find that on the moon. We'd have to take voyage and scout around for our uh, silver. Uh, but I think we did mark out some places with silver on it, so it wouldn't be hard to find. Just rather have it, rather looking at it, looking for it. Okay, um, let me quickly think about this. We have everything else, we have the plates. What do, else does, um, what do you call it, conveyor system take? Interior plate, yeah, we have all that. Okay, I think we're good to go. That's for today's episode. Hopefully in the next one we get to the moon and we can finally get at the resources. And then from there we can do other wee things around the earth once we're done that. We can look for the economy station and then begin looking for uranium. But all that there is to come up in the next episodes or so. Thanks again for watching and if you have any comments or any suggestions at all, make sure to put them in the comments below or put it in the Discord channel. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.